I met AJ when he was 26 years old. The young kid, been in Nicaragua for like maybe two years. Real deal Cuban guy, three generations of tobacco. When I met him, it was like electricity in the air with his passion, with his discipline about tobacco, about cigars. ¿Y quién iba a decir que, la, que hace 10 años íbamos a estar así? Hace 10 años llegamos de Cuba, hace 11 años llegamos de Cuba y hace 10 años teníamos dos parejas. Y hoy, hoy tenemos esto, gracias a Dios. Y eso es debido a la disciplina, al amor que le hemos puesto, al buen tabaco y al buen trabajo. ¿no? Lo que nos separa de las otras fábricas es que nosotros mismos cosechamos nuestro tabaco en nuestras propias, en nuestras propias fincas, tratamos de coger y seleccionar las semillas y las variedades para cada liga y así para poder entregar un producto lo que prefiere el cliente, ¿verdad? Having been to the, the San Latano factory, AJ's you know, factory in Esteli was absolutely amazing. Like the way the factory is set up is just incredibly beautiful. I think to see that kind of process was just, you know, for me, a dream come true as a cigar smoker, to see the whole thing come together from the you know, box factory to the fields, going in and seeing sorting tobacco, being able to see how the grading was done, the packaging, how every stick and every band is put on individually. It was absolutely incredible to watch the whole process take place. Here in the AJ Fernandez sorting room, we take the time to hand select and sort all of our tobacco that comes here at the factory by color, texture, grade, and size. This ensures that over a long period of time, we have a consistency in the blends that we produce. Just the blend that he comes up with and just the genius of what he does, you know, is, it makes it easy as a retailer to say, hey, here's a line that anybody can enjoy. And somebody can start with something mild and graduate and work all the way through all the lines and be really satisfied without ever having a bad experience. During the fermentation process, we bring out the natural color and the natural flavors of our tobacco. Whether filler, binder, or wrapper, we bring out the best that we have in our tobacco here. And the end product is what you have, a premium cigar. You know, the Lajero is unparalleled in flavor, I think, and something that the way that at least AJ does things, you know, where he'll really ferment the tobacco properly for the right length of time, gets all those flavors that people look for in Cuban tobacco or are willing to pay 20 or $25 a cigar in a place where you don't really have to spend that, but you get that kind of richness. We use time-modern traditional methods, our own homegrown tobacco here from Nicaragua, different regions, Jalapa, Condega, Esteli, to make some of the fine products that you see out here on the market, especially the San Lotano and San Lotano Oval, which have been a great success in the American market and in the international market. And the construction on every single stick is always perfect. Not ever something that you have to wonder, oh, is this one going to be tight? Is, you know, just the way that he does things and how he oversees things. With a brand that well made, it's really easy to sell. And the price point's fantastic.
all the time, my goal was that this kid should get what he deserves. Because he's like a gift for the cigar industry. Todo lo bueno que nos ha pasado a nosotros ha sido debido al gran apoyo que hemos tenido de todos los trabajadores de nosotros, la lealtad de ellos hacia nosotros y nosotros hacia ellos también, ¿verdad? Le tratamos de dar todos los beneficios que quieran y siempre agradecido eternamente con toda nuestra Nicaragua. Well, I mean, honestly, I think Nicaraguan tobacco has been the future of cigar tobacco for a long time. And I think it's gotten better and better and better as the years have come on. A lot of people will come in and say, oh, well, is Cuban tobacco still the best tobacco? And I say, no, it's not. Nicaraguan's got the best tobacco right now.
Τα ουάνε τα φώτα τα μαωμένα.